Haven't been out here, damn, not one time with the numbers, but I'm out here. Not one time. Hey, S125 Pepsi did it again, boy. But, uh, Aguilera, man. 110 years. Shit. Truck drivers better be checking this shit. Checking your brakes. You got an air leak or something. You better go fix it now. It's not playing. I've never seen a truck driver get 110 years. Can we see somebody in the car get a, a shitload of years when they do stupid shit? Or they just gonna get probation? Damn! They got that boy. I expect them to, you know, punish him, but damn it, man. Whoa! I don't think Aguilera is a murderer. How should I put it? A killer, even though people got killed. I don't think he intentionally did it to those people. But you had to use your brain, boy. You had to use your brain. Take a ramp. You went past like I think three of them. You got to take the truck out, lay it down, or something. It would have been better than. Um, running into all those people, man. Damn it. Taking one of them ramps, man. I'd rather run up one of them ramps and let my tires sink in and get my ass pulled out of that motherfucker instead of getting pulled out of a fire. You know. Now you gotta pull all kinds of strings to get out of this situation. Man. Four deaths. Oh, yeah. 41 charges. Man, they're trying to hit you with anything they can hit you with. To make sure it sticks. I know he can't hear me, but damn it, man. Truck drivers, truck drivers. You want to go drive for Winging It Express? LLC, we'll fix it later. Logistics. We don't give a fuck cargo. We stay on the shoulder all the time, carriers. We wanna drive for them type of people. Oh, as my boy Josh said, oh raggedy ass trucks. I mean, it can happen with any truck though. We drive for people who don't give a damn about their equipment or, you know, check their stuff. You know, they already pulled on people's uh, safer. We pulled the safer. And uh, they stay having brake problems at that company. Stay having brake problems. It is tragic because he probably wasn't driving for them that long. I forgot how long he was driving for that company. And it just so happened to be every time, you know, you get stopped, it's a brake problem. Not him, but the, that company. It's a brake problem. It's a brake problem. It's a brake problem. Brakes. 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 You know, some company tires. Brakes. Tires. Just so happened to be this man right here. Uh, well, he was a kid. He was like 22 when it, whatever it was when he did it. I thought, what, what was he when he did it? He just happened to be the guy driving one of them trucks. I don't know. I don't even know how they could uh, reconstruct the the whole deal of the truck and it's failures or whatever because it was burnt to a crisp but I'm sure they got him because yo you just ran by all the ramps you ran by all the ramps you really didn't do 
anything to make that truck. I mean, I don't know, man. It's, it's in the books, man. Those escape ramps. And you wonder why they're coming up with some of this new stuff uh, for drivers and training and everything. A lot of things is happening out here. Truck drivers and some truck companies, you did it to yourself. You did it to yourself. What is it? They got to have like, what is it? Uh, a registry now for, uh, for new truck drivers? All kinds of stuff, man. But Mr. Aguilera, man, damn it, boy. families of the victims and his family. I mean, where's the truck company at? Was the truck company on trial? Did, did, did they hammer them? I mean, uh, the lawyer asked to try to get it in gear. He can say, yeah, all he wants to. He wasn't getting that bitch back in gear, boy. No. He was already gone at a point of no return. What he had a freight liner, uh What he had a freight liner century? Manual. Once you get past a certain speed and you can't get it down, it's a wrap. You can try to jam it in, you might get away with it. Depending how my fast yard and we are RPMs at at that point, but uh, going that fast, not even ten. He wasn't getting back in. No gears, none, none. Very tragic, man. Like I said, oh, he, he needed to get hit, you know. There's something as far as uh, jail time or whatever. I don't know about the 100 years. But you truck drivers, y'all better watch out what the hell y'all be doing, man. You people ain't playing. And we know half the stuff, but uh, more, most of this stuff be people in cars fault. But when you get into something, they ain't even playing. They gonna use that whole professional thing on you, even though some people, you know, don't even belong in truck and they little infants. They got the billboards out there in Colorado, Denver, all around the place promoting. I don't want to say promoting, but yeah. Hit by a truck, give us a call. You ain't never seen those damn signs out there until that happened. Never. That said, we're gonna slide on over here, pick up this load, and uh, New Mexico drivers driving these trucks. Maintain your lane, maintain your speed, down shift, use your jakes, get the proper gear going down these hills, man. And don't burn them up. Don't burn them brakes up, boy. You burn them brakes up, you don't know how to use a stab technique. You too could be like Mr. Aguilera. 